Yeah, I was really nervous. I th honestly, I think my parents were a little more nervous for me. Here I am, the 17 year old, new to the business, fresh meat, coming in and hitting it off with the big dogs and it was kind of nerve wracking, yeah. So much to do, jumped out of bed, I started running. Feed the dog, check the phone, my head is buzzing. I got too much on my plate, I barely started this day. It's just like yesterday. I will tell you that um, writing with Laura Valentine was actually really cool because any young person who has the discipline to actually journal their ideas and to have great content and great lyrics and great titles and ideas, that's that makes co-writing so much easier and so much more enjoyable. We don't have the melody all tightened up yet, but it's something like this. I lived inside myself. I hid inside my shirt. Dude! Yeah. It's freaking cool, man. I love it. Hey, is that hey. video? Yeah. Terrifying. This is my journal. It's my private journal, and um, most of the songs that I write come out of this journal. I want to be the girl that makes you proud. Lift someone when they're feeling down. I've had this journal for about two years now, and it comes in handy for great, wonderful songs. So you'll be hearing a lot from my journal soon. The great thing is Laura brought in strong ideas, knows who she is, what her passion is, what her platform is, the things that, that she will talk about from stage. Yeah, yeah. Oh my really God. Simple. Why don't we just write that real quick? Yeah, yeah, since, since, we're, since, yeah. since we're right on that. Yeah. Oh, Ain't it crazy? Nice, nice I could whisper and you could hear me you say, say like take that. me to Ooh, that that's place. the magic right there. What? I don't know why I was scared to jump. Some of the best songs come in five to ten minutes, and uh, that song, Sea of Mercy, was a song that um, Laura was just reading something at the end of the day after we had written two other songs, uh, just reading scribblings in her journal, and I'm like, swimming in a sea of mercy, diving in a lake of grace, good night, are you only 17? <laughs> Ian is just one cool cat, that's probably how I'd describe him. He's like, He's like a teenager stuck in a um, adult body. <laughs> There's something about being chosen that feels oh so beautiful. I haven't a doubt that you're always gonna be right here. Well, as you know, Laura Valentine has a uh, an adoption ministry that is the primary focus of all her music. There are other people who are out there that sing and perform and raise money for adoptions, but I'm not aware of anybody that's a, an orphan themselves that is doing this, so that's a little bit unusual, but that's where her heart is and her passion. These songs will encourage these kids to embrace being adopted just because someone came over and got you from a different family and adopted you and their family. It doesn't mean that you're any different from anyone else. I think it means you're a little more special, you know? And just to embrace being adoptive because it's a it's a cool story to tell. I'm stronger than you. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. You don't